One, two, and up. Out, out, release. Sure. Oh, nice. So we'll see. Okay. I don't really know what I'm going for. Get it on YouTube. Everything's on YouTube, bro. Yeah, matter of fact, what you just said is going on you fucking tube. <laughs> One, two, up. Gained a couple of elbows in the last week. I've been eating good, so I'm at about 312 right now. So I was about 304 last time we filmed. Oh, you yeah? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so you put it on like a chair. Yeah, well, I starved myself so I don't get big. So if I give myself just a little, it's like, oh. I've been 390 before. This is like, I gotta hold it down. And I do it on purpose, just, nothing's wrong, just, you know, at 51 years old, how many fucking 400 pound dudes you know walking around like that? Yeah. None. Yeah. So I kind of wanted to remain walking, so I just took it off. It's a good way to be after you. Between this and 320, optimal. But I'm thicker, my traps are thicker, you can definitely see the difference on me now. I'm feeling, I feel better. Starving sucks. It's just, you know, you're, you're just not a hundred. Put your inner tricep on the dimple, and then squeeze the back back. See, right there, you're perfect on your inner tricep. Now, when you pull back, look at me when I pull back. I'm not doing what you're doing, this. I'm in here. And then I'm pulling with my back and my arm. And I'm pulling and pulling. And my belly, pushing my belly out to it. I'm not breaking, look at me. This never happens. As soon as you do, I have a, an analogy about a tree. When a car runs into a tree, who wins? The tree. When you climb on a tree, the initial branches that come off the trunk, you can climb on them, you can build a tree house. But what happens to all the dangly branches? They break. So why would you put anything in your body into that dangly branch position? Like, like you know how to fight? All right, come here. If I, if me and you were fighting, and I just went like this, I'm not gonna hit you, brother. If I just went like that, what did I just open up for you? A whole bunch of shit. You can arm bar me, you can throw me, you know, but if I come in here, okay, you ain't doing shit now. And so, try to get in on me. So I try and wait. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. I can contain. It. Okay. So lifting, you need to contain the weight. If you're in here and you're in your whole body and you're benching from your toes all the way up, you're squatting from your toes up, you're deadlifting from your toes up. You're never going to have a dangly branch position because everything works as chain drive. Okay. Chain drive meaning like a bicycle chain. Yeah. Every What is the best link in a bicycle chain? None. They all work as one. What happens when one of those links on that bicycle break? You, you no longer have a chain. So the first thing we need to learn is how to tie this in with everything. So, 
pinch back. You want to make your body, look at me, you want your body as close in as possible. So instead of doing this, I'm not, I'm doing this. And I'm taking my body, and I'm thick, you know what I mean? I'm taking myself and I'm turning it into thinness. So the bar might not go to my chest. No, it's not going to yet. Just learn that. I was kind of forcing the bar down. Don't worry about touching right That makes it, that makes me loosen up. Right. So what I'm going to teach you is on a high board, and then you're going to get that, and then I'm going to drop a board. Then you're going to get that, I'm going to drop a board all the way until you touch. Okay? Pull it with your arms. I was thinking, bring the bar to my chest. Right. You know, but, but that's not Seven what's happening. Reps. Let's load it up, boys. Alright. You're one of the boys. Go. Seven, Seven reps. reps. You've just been initiated. So I got this new shirt. So he sent me one that was too big. Then he sent me one that was too small. Now supposedly he made me one that's in between. So hell, you're here, I'm here. Let's give her a run. What happens? Uh -huh. You know, worst comes to worst. If it ain't for me, I'll f you know keep working at it hard till it is for me. Just gotta work through it, man. That's way too much of a guy. Okay, so is it a guy or a company that makes it? It's a guy that ceramic coats guns for a living. He's in like Pennsylvania, just just a lifter that just fucking came out with this crazy ass shit. So hopefully it's the right size. Okay. If it's the right size and it gives me some support. Hey, you notice what he did, Phil? He built it up higher for me. Okay. Yeah, to give more. Effect. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, Mike. Man, he does it quick. Man. He built this up on the top more for the shoulder. Look, it's yeah. got a fucking, like that much, bro. You actually listen to me. Fucking Rob, I love you, brother. Hey, Mike, grab the blue stuff. The, the sticky shit. All right. Yeah. You know how to, you 
right there. That's great. Jeez. It's not bad at all. How long has it been since you touch? It's like, how long has it been you see your dick? <laughs> I didn't even know I had a dick. <laughs> I was off balance, so I just held it for a while. Yeah, what's up, Rico? It didn't feel like that much power for me. I had to kind of struggle it up to the top. Touching is not hard for me. I, I could touch. I just I'm trying to build that heavier weight up. See the surprise on my face when I touch? I could touch. I just Up. That's good. Quarter inch. Yeah, 
Yeah, I mean, I don't care about touching with that. That's really a touch. You know, a bodybuilding bench press compared to a, a powerlifting bench press is a different planet. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, because you're only isolating the chest and you're not using anything else. You know what I mean? And that's to build. So it's not wrong. It's right. It's just it's another word. So to learn proper bench press technique when a guy walks through the door, mm -hmm. you're talking about a year. Um, and like Mike's been with me a year and he almost has it. in your body, what are you doing? Now get your ankles down and push back onto your trap. Now stay there. Do not let your ankles move. Start to let move up. Three. Don't throw it. Four. Don't breathe. I uh, have to relearn that. You hold, you gotta hold. So, deep breath, deep breath. If you have to breathe, on, if you're doing simple, on the top, when you're locked out, you're tight, take another breath. But you don't breathe on the way up. Okay. You lose your power. Got you. If I'm here and I'm tight, look, I lock up right there. Now, in order for me to, to, to not lock up, look what happens. But I, my shoulder comes out. Yeah. Now I'm gonna hurt myself. Okay. That's probably I why I hurt my shoulders. And right here, here, and I'm fucking tight as fuck, and I need to pull, pull, pull with my back. You see, my arm ain't passing. Yeah. So the bar is not gonna touch my chest. Not with that. Yeah. When you put weight on it, it will. Okay. I mean, you, you know. Then you have to learn how to like push your belly out, and, and like you go to the bar. Yeah. Which is. Really hard. I've been learning that shit. That's what I, I heard him say. Is belly, push your belly to the bar. Yeah. And I, you know, I never, I never heard that. Said. But you know, you're not having to do it because you're doing this. Yeah. When you dump it like that, you rotate the cup. Plus, like, look, so you, how are you gonna press? No, you like that's this. a weak position. Yeah. When you're here, now the weight's in front of you. Boom. Yeah. I know. I'm pulling apart now. <laughs> Pull it down first. I love getting this shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're done. <laughs> yep. How much, Troy? How much weight have you lost in the last month or so? You're leaning out, huh? Am I? Yeah, you are. I was like one seventy. Maybe five, like a week ago, I'm like 164 and I'm like, really? Yep. I'm like, I eat bad, then I'm like, you blow easy? Huh? You blow easy? The salt? No, water. I get more muscle mass. Yep. But I can like shred it. We're actually like four bike right here. No, I like, because it looked like you are just retaining a crap load of water. Troy, grab my shirt, wipe me down. It's right there.
Go. Fuck out of here. Being a pussy, I'll get it. Touch. You broke the eight minute mile, baby. You know, four minute mile, you know. Troy, wipe me down, will you, baby? All right. Uh. Hey, 
shirt he's made me, you know, R&D, 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 oh, we'll get it. Okay. 